This is the Facebook Sound Collection. I'm going to show you not only how to access the Sound Collection, but also how you can source, download, and use different music and sound effects on your content. Awesome! Before we can do those things first, we need to access the Facebook Sound Collection. To do that, make sure you're logged into the homepage of the Meta Business Suite and navigate over to the left-hand menu bar until you see all tools. Click on it and do a search for sound and this will filter out the sound collection. It will open in a new window, so click on it. Here we are. You can see up at the top, we've got the tracks and the sound effects. Let's scroll down slowly until we see some of the tracks which are available here in the sound collection. We can see that on the left hand side there is the name of the song, who the artist is, the genre, the tempo and the length of the track. If we come across to the left hand side there are three buttons. The first one which is the drop down uh, button that is the download so if you like a particular track you can click on this button and it is going to download the track onto your computer if you see the play button that is going to allow you to play the track and see if it is a good match for the content which you are trying to create and if you want to share that content with yourself or make a note of it for later you can click on the i button next to the play button and that will bring up the song information which you can copy onto your computer and then paste in an email or into the Facebook Messenger for later. If we exit out of it, let's go to the top headline section, which is very important. We can see that you can choose from a range of different genres. So if you have a brand which is geared towards people who are interested in rock, you can select the filter there. You can choose the mood of rock and let's say we want something which is more confident and we want to have a track which is longer than two minutes with vocals that are male oriented and we have a tempo that is at a medium pace. You can now see that we have got 10 tracks which have been filtered down from all of the options available. If we <clears throat> uncheck everything we can slowly begin to see that more tracks become available each and every time so the great thing about the sound collection is that it allows you to find music and sound effects that are unique to what you are looking for we can also sort it by recently added and the most popular so let's go to the most popular and you can see it has now been filtered effectively and remember, at any one time, if you want to preview the track, you just need to press the play button. And the same is available for the sound effects. Now, the great thing about sound effects is that if you're looking to engage people a little bit more, maybe make them laugh or smile or catch their attention, sound effects are fantastic for that. So let's say we want to get people's attention with an air horn. We can just do a search in the bar there and we can see that the air horn sound effect is here. Let's play. Fantastic, and let's say we like the sound effect enough, let's download that. It's going to save to our computer, and if we want to share it for later, let's copy the sound effect link. So, all you need to do once you have got that is go into your video editing software, download that track into your particular video editing software and you can then use this sound collection or sound effects in your organization or business content so that's it for today's video everybody thank you so much for watching i hope you got a lot of value out of it if you like this video don't forget to smash that like button down below and consider subscribing if you are new to the channel we post new video tutorials every single week and if you have any questions, you can always leave a comment down below and I'll aim to answer your questions as soon as I can. Thanks so much for watching and have a fantastic day, everybody.